Hi guys, it's Asa Cruptus. Today I want to show you how I made these uh, trims here that I just made. I actually want to make more color than more color than this one as you know. I love to make like um, 20, 30 or 50 trims all different kind of color I have but I fortunately I ran out of two that I make for trims so I can make only stick of them, you know, this five and one more to show you ladies how I how I did it. So this one is kinda of blue. This one is dark blue maybe and this one green and uh, more mustard and this one oh turn around. this one is actually red but I think it came out in pink one. It's isn't that pretty? Um this one I I saw it's at my work, when I walk by at a cosmetic, they have the headband. It's really tiny one, and I look at it. I don't know how they did it, so I just guessing on my own way how to twist this. So, what I'm going to do? You don't want to cut the chipboard or anything that you want. This one, a pizza box. This, so this one is twelve inches by three and a quarter. The first time when I made it, I didn't measure it, so this one is kind of big. But after I think I like the three quarter, and then you will need you need a ribbon. Don't know where I put my ribbon. Oh. So this one the ribbon wide. Um, not sure how wide that is. One and a half wide ribbon. So this I want to cut a little bit over 12 inches long there you don't have to use a uh, certain ribbon right now you can use anything the fabric that you want for the on the inside there And the two that I use, the two I cut um, 46 inches by, let me see, 3 inches. And you can grimace anything that you want. This one I just dye with um, re-inker stamming up and um, rubbing alcohol. This one you can buy at your local pharmacy. Nothing fancy or special anything. I listen to you this because it dry faster remember so remember this is um, water base it the color the trim is cannot touch the water uh, the water you know if you drop the water on this trim the color will fade it okay um what color should I use I have pink I have perfect plum I have soft fish maybe I should use chocolate one so I just gonna drop a couple color in there couple drops in there this uh, spray bottle I have this a lot of these this one is good for just the water you cannot use um, the powder in there, it will clog up, so I don't suggest don't use for um, make your own cream mist that you use any uh, powder in there. So then you might try there and I'm gonna spray, I'm gonna move this one away so that one not get um, in or over. I'm just gonna spray this. I hope I will finish this um, tutorial before Cody wake up. He actually holy mommy boy at the moment. Everything has to be with mommy. Mommy cannot leave his side. It has to be the same room with mommy the whole time even though he ignore mommy. So I'm going to let this one dry. You know, and, uh, as you know that I love to use a rubbing and get hot because it 
dry faster. I made a chocolate chip one because um, I might use it on my layout later. I don't know yet. But good to have all different kind of color. I'm gonna dry this one. one pretty much dry and also the two see this one already dry really fast huh okay now uh, we're gonna use this the pizza box that I did cut and you want to press this one because you don't want it to to show on the in the front there this one gonna be on the back so can I hear this piece there this you know you can this technique you can do so many things headband trims or corsage you know and just fall like this sorry I forgot to say something is it follow me okay and it's just gonna to do like that here the pleat piece together there I'm trying not to, to get a love on another side you wanna get it tight as much possible as you can After that, we're gonna the two here. You wanna fold in half, and then you wanna fold in half again. Okay. You know, you the hot glue, and then place this behind. That PG guy can see it. So light up the two and this piece even there and um, then then 
when you that way and then you want to twist it you use this finger here twist on there and it's uh, center there to get this look okay and same thing you wanna line up this one this to the is the next one same thing use your finger here twist it there to get the cross like uh what is it called uh cross it or something like this I'm not sure anyway see that the trim long or short it depends on uh, how you twist your uh, this step okay sometimes I have the two left over a lot sometimes I have a left a little bit I think it's because it depends how I twist it and how far the speed I want it to be do like that all the way in the end see for any end is kind of like a little bit left spit because it um, see not enough space to twist and if I left this on all oh, that's so I have to redo a little bit couples of them to get line up perfectly see that see there so I like to the end better See there. It's really easy and simple to make your um, trunks, or you make this for headband, you know, and yeah, um, or corsage, whatever that on your purpose. Purposes say that I really love this sparkle height, and now I can't wait to use this for my layout. Okay, that's it lady. Thank you ladies for keep watching my video. I will see you guys later. Bye.